So uh, we stopped again on the road trip uh, heading to uh, Kusumo and uh, stopped at this beach that you can see behind us and uh, we found uh, some sort of a life-saving uh, demonstration or something here. Actually I'm going to uh, turn the camera around and let, what is your name? Anne. Ah, Anne. Yeah. Okay and I'm gonna let Anne uh, describe it to you so let's turn the camera. All right so Anne can you explain to us what you're doing here? <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, yeah. So hi for everyone. So we have uh, like wisely on water tour, and we demonstrate how you can save somebody's life in a, in water. So we use some uh, equipments like uh, life ring, uh, lifeline, life jackets, and how you how uh, and some packet actually so that you can you can save some someone's life on water. Okay, all right. So now we have uh, here some uh, test that you said that you can throw. Uh, that lifeline on the ring if you want to try I can Okay, so I'm gonna try to yes, save someone's yes. life. Okay, and it's running. Okay, so I guess the idea is I have to try to get this as close to that uh, Yeah, that, that point, point there as possible right. uh, Try again Oh, it's just good. I think I'm gonna give one more time. Yes. Third time's a charm. I have a feeling the person and I'm trying your, to rescue your, is gonna die. Your, and put your leg on here. I'm, okay. All right. I have a feeling the person I'm rescuing is gonna die. <laughs> Good. So close. Yeah, so but that's, close. that was good because you can save somebody's life because if somebody's drowning. Yeah. So it's, it's enough that you can uh, grab uh, that. They that can grab thing. it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And the rope. All right. Yeah. Well, thank you for the demonstration. Go ahead. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> So oh, they uh, gave us this cool stuff. They gave us this uh, wet bag. So after you've gone swimming, you can put your uh, your bathing suit and your towel in there and uh, keep everything around that dry. They gave us uh, a couple whistles and uh, a pair of sunglasses. So this is a fun stop. Spending a little bit of time here by the water and uh, getting a chance to learn a little bit about um, life-saving techniques for lifeguards. Finland is known as the uh, land of a thousand lakes and here's just one example of why it claims that moniker. Beautiful water scenery.
In Finland, the number you call is 112. We, of course, call 911. In Finland, call 112 if you need salvation. Hello, my name is Tommi, and I'm a firefighter from Sumsalami. Aha, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Here we have our fire truck and some tools we use in car accidents. We have these blades or any tools here. We can some demonstrate and show you how they will burn. Uh -huh. And I think these are what we call in English the, the jaws of life, right? Yes, jaws of life. And in Finnish you call them the saw of life? Uh, leikkurit ja levittimet. Okay, I'll let her translate that for me. <laughs> All right, anything else uh, that you think is important? to? Now, what's the most important thing on this truck that you would use? Most important thing in this truck is the, the, the pump, water pump. It's here in okay. the back. And how much water does this truck carry? 3,000 liters. 3,000 liters. Okay. Wow. All right. Thank you very much, Tommy. Thank you. And uh, it was really interesting to see one of these trucks right up close. Thanks a lot. Thank you. The one, two, three. Oops. And it goes right through the fingers. Look, I'll make it a little bit more difficult. I'll put them back here. But this time, I'm going to lock them together like this. One, two, three. And it still goes right through the fingers. It's kind of weird. <laughs> Have you guys ever heard of David? <laughs> Have you ever heard of David Copperfield? Yes. Yeah? I taught him everything he knows. <laughs> what are you laughing about? <laughs> Look, true story. <laughs> uh, many years ago, David Copperfield did an illusion where he walked through the wall of China. Did you ever see that? Where he walked through the wall of China? No? No. This is a TV special he did. On the same TV special, he did the trick I'm about to show you now. And the next day in America, more people were talking about this than the walking through the wall of China. But this is what it looks like. Look. See how that rubber band goes right there, so that it's locked here, and it's locked here. It's locked here, and it's locked here. Watch. And they come right <laughs> apart, right like that. <laughs>